Battle of Queenston Heights. What happened? The Battle of Queenston Heights was the first major battle in the War of 1812 and resulted in a British victory. It took place on October 13, 1812, near Queenston, Upper Canada, known today as Ontario. It was fought between United States regulars and New York militia forces, led by Major General Stephen Van Rensler and British led regulars. York and Lincoln militia and Mohawk warriors, led by Major General Isaac Brock and Major General Roger Hale Sheaf, who took command when Brock was killed. The battle was fought as the result of an American attempt to establish a foothold on the Canadian side of the Niagara River before campaigning ended with the onset of winter. This decisive battle was the culmination of a poorly managed American offensive and may be, the, and may be most historically significant for the loss of the British commander. Despite their numerical advantage and the wide dispersal of British forces defending against their invasion attempt, the Americans who were stationed in Lewiston, New York, were unable to get the bulk of their invasion force across the Niagara River to the works of the British artillery and reluctance on part of their undertained and inexperienced American militia. As a result, British reinforcements arrived and defeated the unsupported American forces, forcing them to surrender. Important people associated with the Battle of Queenston Heights. Isaac Brock. Even though he died, he led the British in the first half of the battle. Roger Sheaf. After Brock died, he took over commanding the British.